Yes, the title you've read was correct. The town is wasting your money. A long while ago, the roads of my street had a somewhat decent quality. Then, the town decided to come in and do something about that. Now, you might think that doing something about it is good, but in this case, it wasn't good at all. What the town of Guilford has done is spray the roads with glue and lay down a layer of gravel-ish material. This is also known as chip paving. What this did was it made most street activities impossible now because you couldn't physically do it because it was just too rough to ride anything on the street. As you can see evident of the shaky cap quality as I rode my hoverboard over the gravel. But the real damage happened when winter time came. When the plows came through the street, they shoved all of the gravel from in the road onto the grass and the side of the road. This was very bad, as the road was no longer covered with the gravel that was originally there, and it was all over the lawns. You couldn't mow the lawn without getting rocks thrown at your legs. Come summertime of 2016, the town finally decided to do something about their terrible job before, and the fact that our street was covered with too many cracks and potholes. They paved it over with real pavement, which, good thing, they did it, finally. But they only did our section of the street. There was still the cul-de-sac and front part of the street that was left completely untouched. In summer 2017, we started seeing markings on the road, thinking, hey, they're gonna start paving that too. Well, they did pave it. They chip paved it. And it's winter time now. You could see the devastating effects that all of this chip paving does. You could see gravel along the side of the road from where the plows have scraped it off and shoved it to the side. You could see all of your hard-earned money right there on the ground. In some places, the gravel is so deep, I could take a handful and pick it up. This is a very bad thing as well, because when the road is scraped up, the town will just come over and chip pave it once more. This slowly adds up in cost. Similar sections of the town were also chip paved over the summer of 2017. For asphalt, it normally costs 1.25 million per square mile. This is a lot less than that, but after time it adds up. For chip paving, it's 1250 per square yard, but the road is a quarter of a mile long and 25 feet wide. All that converted over equals 44,000 dollars each time they chip pave the road. This is a lot of money. Your money being spent just to chip pave the road. As you can see from this photo, the rocks are covering the grass, keeping it from getting sunlight and keeping it from growing, slowly killing it. There are many other sections of just pure gravel. Gravel that's so thick in some places, you could stick your hand deep into it. This this is a huge problem. The town, each time they do this, they think it's acceptable to do something like this. This is completely unacceptable. Spending your hard-earned cash on roads that are just getting ruined the year afterward and ruining people's lawns, causing more money to be spent to fix those roads and the people to spend money on fixing their lawn. Also, as a taxpayer, you're paying for the snowplow that runs the street that completely tears up the road. In this picture here, you can clearly see the cause of all of this. The snowplow's plow line. From right here, you can see the line that the plow has left as it stopped with the gravel right there. Just from one run down the street, it took up this much gravel. This is one year's worth of gravel right here. Just one pave gone. You could feel the road underneath, the previous road. There's nothing left. The plows have taken it all up and pushed it off to the side. It's not useful anymore. What was once made to be useful is now no longer useful. It's useful. What was made for your cars to drive on is now nothing but the old road. You're not driving on anything new anymore because the plows came and tore it all up. What I'm saying isn't to stop chip paving or to stop plowing the roads. All I'm doing is providing information to those that are uninformed about the problems that this town is facing with its roads. Thank you for your time, and have a great day.